Uh, now, this one is different. The objects are now moving. So you have a hanging mass and a counter mass. So uh, usually or dapat, dapat magkaiba yung mass nila. Ano? Kasi hindi siya tataas or bababa kung magkaparehas yung mass. Magiging equilibrium kasi siya. Ano? In this case, we have an elevator, elevator car, and a counterweight. So the elevator is heavier than the counterweight by 150 kilogram. The elevator is 1,150 kilogram, while the counterweight is only 1,000 kilogram. Okay, so syempre, kung sino mas mabigat, siya yung bababa. And may hila niya pataas yung counter mass. The counter mass is usually uh, the lighter in weight. Okay? In this case, we're looking for the acceleration of the elevator and the tension along the cable. Okay, um, so syempre may tension dito, di ba? And then may tension doon. So, isa lang naman yung tali that, that is connecting both of object um, at both ends. Okay? So, the tension that the, that, that, that the objects are experiencing would be the same. Okay? Tension is always pulling. Okay? And then, uh, the acceleration will also be equal. So, kung ano yung acceleration ng elevator car pababa, ganun din yung acceleration noong counterweight pataas. The only difference is, the elevator is going down, the acceleration is negative, while the counterweight is going up, and the acceleration is positive. Okay, let's try to solve this problem. So, as I have said, you will be drawing first the FPD, di ba? Standard operating procedure na yan. FPD of elevator and FPD of counter mass or the counterweight. So, simple. Simple lang ang FPD nila, di ba? Now, I have a weight. Sorry. I have a... Um, the weight of the elevator and I have the weight of the counter mass, counter weight and there is a tension no? may kabig pa din yung counter weight on the elevator otherwise the elevator will, will just uh, no, no, will just uh, go down walang mag uh, slow down sa kanya so the tension on the elevator is upwards and the tension on the counterweight is upward as well. Otherwise, it will, now, it will not accelerate upwards. Okay. Also, remember to put the accelerations, the direction of the accelerations rather, para hindi ka malito while you're solving. Now, to solve for the acceleration, I will give you a formula. No? This is the formula that you will use for these cases. Hanging mass and when there's a counter mass. So the heavy mass, I'm talking about the mass in kilogram of the heavier object, the elevator in this case, and the mass of the light minus the light mass, which in this case is the counterweight, and then the sum of the masses. If you say you will add the masses divided by G. So solve not any acceleration. Using this formula, there is a derivation for this equation, I know, but uh, due to time constraint, I will not be teaching you the derivation. Okay, gabitin na lang ninyo yung ating formula. So, air acceleration, um, heavy mass, which is 1,150 kilogram minus 1,000 kilogram. The sum of uh, the both masses, I believe, is uh, 2,150. Now, uh, 9.8 meter per second squared. Uh, I believe if you put this in your al cal calculator, this will be 0 0.86 meter per second squared. No, because you will cancel the kilograms. And then you, you will be left with meter per second squared. So that is my acceleration. Sige, so let's go dito. I need to uh, delete this computation kasi wala nang spaces, sir. 
Please take note of that equation. Okay. So now, magsasama ko ng forces on the elevator. Pwede din doon sa, ano, sa counter mass. But here, I chose the elevator. Some of the forces along the y, mass times acceleration. So the tension is upwards minus the weight of the elevator. The mass of the equals the mass of the elevator and the acceleration. So right now, hindi natin bibigyan to ng zero or hindi natin to consider the zero kasi syempre gumagalaw siya. We have computed nga the acceleration, di ba? And also remember, kapag elevator, yung pinag-uusapan natin, siya yung bumababa. Okay, it is speeding up while going to the negative direction. Therefore, the acceleration is negative. Huwag mong kalimutan yun kasi magbabago ang iyong masasol kapag hindi mo siya ginawang negative. Now, the weight of the elevator is 1,150 kilogram times 9.8 meter per second squared. Okay, sab kakasabi ko lang kanina. <laughs> Equals, the mass is 1,150 1, kilogram times uh, negative 0.68 meter per second squared. Okay. Okay, I believe this one will be equal to 11,470 newtons. And on the right side, it will be equal to um, this much. Negative 782 newtons. So if I transpose the 11,000 on the other side, it will become positive. No? So, sige, try transpose ko na siya dito because I don't have a lot of space. And then if I subtract the 2, I will be getting 10,488 newtons. That will be my tension. Or, um, 10,000.5 kilo newtons. So that's my process in solving for uh, problems involving hanging mass and counter mass.